welcome back to another episode. I am the Colonialist, and you're joining me for this week's look through the Antiverse at some of the amazing things that are available for your colonies. This episode is sponsored by Ants HQ. Links in the description. I received this beautifully wrapped, incredibly carefully packaged nest. I'm actually still trying to work out if it's a nest or a piece of artwork because it's absolutely stunning. If you're unfamiliar with it, Ants HQ have teamed up with Foranto who makes these beautifully carved wooden nests. And of course, this makes them individual and unique because each nest is shaped differently compared to the wood that it's been cut from. If you have a species that is suitable for a wooden nest and you are looking for something to house them in and you want something that is also a showpiece, then this nest ticks all the boxes. It is actually stunning and I can't get over the ridge of this nest. It's beautiful. Simple, elegant and well made. I can just speak volumes for this nest. I love looking at the back of it. I have added in, however, a little 3D printed stopper, which I'll link in the description. And I've also added in the PVC tubing. Those do not come as standard with the nest. Those are modifications that I've made, and I will be making a couple other modifications to the nest as I go forward to make it a better environment for the ants. This includes adding on red acetate covering and so on. Just to note, this nest is not hydrated, so you will need to provide fresh water to your colonies in the outworld that you attached to this nest. Again, look at these edges. They're stunning. I wanted to get some footage of a species using the nest, so I temporarily hooked up my Camponotus nicobarensis colony to check the nest out, and they had fun doing so. I have since disconnected them from the nest and got all the workers out from inside, and they are back in the 3D printed nest where they have actually started to move brood into. I believe my plan going forward is to add in my Camponotus japonicus colony and see how they get on with this nest. I'm really excited to get on with that. Let me know what you think in the comments regarding this nest, how stunning it is. I mean, it truly is stunning. I, I can't speak enough volumes for that. It's a piece of art almost. If you're watching this and you have one of these nests, please let me know in the comments what you think of them and what species you house. For now, this is me, the Colonialist, signing out.